All right, all YouTubers out there, it's competition day. Well, kind of. Uh, it is competition day, but it's going to be a little bit different for yours truly. Uh, I found out two days ago that I have a uh, partial tear in my right bicep. So, Doc has told me, unless you want it to fully rip out and have surgery, probably would not be smart to lift heavy weights. So, I have been pretty upset the past couple days. My poor family has had to deal with my moodiness. But, we are going anyway to, uh, to help out, to cheer on the other athletes. And so, I'll take some footage of the event and uh, we'll just make a day of it. So stay tuned. All right, we're here at the event. Uh, this is kind of the pre we are. Uh, amble before the storm. Things are just like mine, Foster. Curious to see, I, I did a little talking here in the actual video. Don't know if the voiceover will take care of that or not. But these are just some of the implements that are gonna be Oops. using. Uh, people are just getting ready. This is where most of the time is spent is when it, getting it kicked off versus uh, the actual events. And then the time in between events is also just as freaking long. So uh, everybody's just right, having a little fellowship up. and getting ready for the show. Just some more getting along. Over here is the shirts. Look at that shirt. Cool, there you go. That's cool. That's a great design this year. Yeah. Anticipation. Okay. Just had the rules meeting. Athletes are getting ready. Warming up right now. We're about to get this sucker going. This is the lightweight division. Most of these uh, uh, videos that I'm showing, these clips, are of them just warming up. I didn't get a chance to get film ready. a lot of the actual competition. The sandbag toss. Just because uh, they had me acting as one of the judges, and so I was busy doing that. And so I was glad to be able to at least get some some video of yeah, the actual better. warm up of the events prior to them starting. Yeah, probably like 70 years in this body. I'm telling it at least. All so right. are you, are you yes. If I was competing, this would be my group. Uh, okay. Yeah. 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 I'm at 70 right now, and I've got oh. right now, and I've killed my hearing test, and I've got tinnitus, and um, they're reevaluating yeah. my spine. Bam. Okay. Yeah. Then I'm just going to travel to go and be strong. Yeah. 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 There you go. People are getting ready for the... Uh, the yoke kid Negley. Somebody's training, getting warmed up. I was really excited about this event. <laughs> There's some peeps right here. Nobody's just named There's the main power Dad. lifter right down there. That's the winner right there. You're Dino. Oh. They just named him Dino Cantagrassi. Right. That's my son. 
this is actually the keg over bar. So you basically have to get your keg, put it over the bar for height. So you get three different attempts. You get to select your height. Um, this probably would have been my worst event if I would have competed because I'm not super tall. And that's that. Rock it out, Lord. I would have loved to have done this. This is the car deadlift. Man, always wanted to do this. So maybe next year. I went ahead and kept this in the video. Uh, this is all basically the, the first place winner in all the different weight classes. So uh, it's kind of neat just to be able to showcase everybody's hard work. Uh, it was a lot of fun and it was nice getting to meet people. And I'll tell you what, there's nobody nicer than people in Strong Man. Very supportive, even though it's a competition, we still are there to just support each other and help each other along the way. People were giving people advice on what to do and how to do it. I mean, it was just a neat atmosphere. That is one of the things that I love so much about Strongman. Landon. And the victors go to the spoils. I don't know if you can tell, but what they're getting as prizes is it's a, it's a little red flask and it has the event information on it, the, the name, the date, and all that fun stuff. And then um, at the very end, uh, you can see there on the table, there's two mini kegs. And that goes to the overall female uh, athlete and the overall male athlete, which is kind of a cool little extra, extra gift. Robert! That dude right there had 22 reps uh, on the car deadlift. Masters men, Eric. This would have been my group. Uh, he probably would have been my main competition. Super nice guy. And Hope to compete against him in the future. All first place winners, David Huckleby, also wants you guys to have a free entry to his show that is October 28th, I believe, in Melbourne. Um, he asked me to send your name and email address, so I'm going to do that if that is okay with all of you. Um, we also have um, overall winners for male and overall winners for the female. All right, as you can tell, I'm a little lobstery. Um, we were outside in the sun, 9,500 degree weather, a little bit longer than I suspected we would be. Uh, but it was fun, it was great. You know, my major disappointment is not being able to compete because of my injury. But uh, we'll uh, take care of that and we'll be ready for the next one. But uh, they threw me in as one of the judges. So I got to help judge and uh, and it was it was a lot of fun. Uh, met a whole lot of cool people. Uh, it's nice to be somewhere where you're one of the more skinnier people in the group. <laughs> but anyway, 
this one's in the books. Uh, next step is to uh, go see the doc to find out about my arm, how long it's gonna recover, and then uh, go from there. So in the meantime, you guys get out there, do the best you can, don't let anybody stop you, tell you can't do something, and get your fit on.